Alô? Alô?
Esteemed brother, this is Sayyid Brother, who has been here. The Federal Half, this is from Bob Sahana and other family members. My esteemed sister and brother, Darius, Sri Shishu Kapat Singh, Adish to Charles Stephen Wakil, Sri Adit Kumar Singh, Adish to Advocate General, Sri Rata Kant, Pucha, President, Fight of Bar Association, Sri Pradeep Kumar, President, Advocates Association, Madam Senior Advocates, State Law Officers, Members of the Bar, Officers of the Ministry, Ladies and Gentlemen. We yeah. assembled here to give farewell to Brother Mrs. Sayyid Rai's name, who is committing office today on any of the age of Sukhara. Mrs. Pia born on 25, 1961 in Delhi. After completing his schooling in his hometown, it is PA Honors, LLB, and LLM Company at the Street School University. Mrs. Pia, having cleared the PCSJ examination, Joined judicial service in the year 1987 as PC. He was promoted to the Court of Five Judicial Service in 2005 and was promoted as district judge in the year 2017. He was elevated as a judicial judge of this court on June 21, 22. This is near to the five years, has always been dedicated towards his judicial work in his judicial career. And when serving as a judge of this court, has decided to do that. This is wise man. He will always be remembered as a decent and strong judge. He never lost his composure. He has been kind and courteous. He showed the same level of humility to every member of the bar that is in the While sitting in court, he always exhibited fairness, respect, and dignity to the advocates and litigators who appeared before him. Mr. Pina has provided all help with an institution and litigant expect from a judge in the start of his constitutional duties. She tells me he will always be remembered for his positive attitude and approach to his tenure in High Court has been shocked that he served the judicial system for 35 years. She Mumtaz Khan, better half of this year, had always been a source of strength, inspiration, and success for him. She tells me readily and dare himself to all his companions in the reform and during the relationship with all of us. Now, at this moment of departure from the institution, we have to miss his company. I, on behalf of my sister and other brothers, and the Bar, and myself, wish Mrs. Sayyid Bai's name the best of luck for the life of life. We wish that life has precious things in store for him. May the next phase of your life be more grateful and elegant. May God bless you with everything he deserves and desires. Thank you.
हम My Lord, the Honorable Chief Justice, the Honorable Mr. Justice, the Honorable Judges, the Dash, a respected members of the Bar, Editor Solicitor General of India, President of the Bar Association, Radha Khan Bihari, President of Medical Education, Mahdi, Chief Distinguished Member of this August Conference, ladies and gentlemen. It is indeed a privilege for me to be given this opportunity to say a few words. On the superdition of his lordship, Honorable Mr. Justice Ed Well Mian, as a judge of our High Court. Honorable Mr. Justice Well Mian did his initial schooling at the Desi Primary School, Bareilly, and then attended Christian Vidyan Inter College, Bareilly. His lordship graduated in three honors and LLB, honors from the Alicard Muslim University, and also did his LLM. Mr. Justice Well Mian was an excellent student, and during his school and college days, he was the favorite of his teacher due to his good work and polite manners. Those who knew his lordship in those days because his helpful nature and he willingly helped his classmates in their study. And even Mr. Justice said when Mia joined as a monster in UP Judicial Service in 1987 and was appointed to the Hague Judicial Service in 2005. His lordship was elevated as a judge of our high court. In 2022. And it was just well, Mia is equally proficient in matter on both the criminal as well as the civil sides. A glimpse of his multiplex legal acumen has been reflected in various judgments he had passed. The common denominator in all his lordship judgment is the supreme grasp of law, his vast vocabulary, and extraordinary command over language, and an incomparable ability to examine and analyze the facts of each case. Consequently, his judgment or a wayman's value to his brother judges and to liars, and they still set the foundation of jurisprudence and they are presented for the future. Helpful nature of his lordship has constantly remained with his personality. Whenever any person gives advice or is facing any difficulty, be it personal or in context of their duty, they are always sure of his willingness to guide and advise. Our regret is that. Or associated with the lordship was not longer duration. We shall always receive smiling countenance and his sharp judicial acumen shall remain a pattern of inspiration for generation. It is with a regret that we bid him a fond welcome, and on behalf of all the council of the state, I wish his lordship a long and happy life with well deserved and contented retirement. Thank you. My Lord Honorable Just Chief Justice, My Lord Honorable Justice Sayyad was Mia, Mrs. is better of Muntaz Shohan, Honorable Judges sitting on the dais, Sri S.P. Sasi Prakash Singh, Additional Solicitor General, Government of India, Mr. Rajit Kumar Singh, Additional General, State of UP. My senior member of the bar, junior member of the bar, ladies and gentlemen. We have gathered here to give bid farewell to Honorable Justice Sayed Vaiz Mia, who is demeaning his office after completing his full tenure as a judge of the High Court and the court below after about more than 35 years of service. My Lord is born on 5 1 1961 in District Bareilly and has completed his primary education from primary school Sirauli, District Bareilly. My Lord has completed his graduation honors and LLB honors, including LLM from Aligarh Muslim University, Aligarh. My Lord has been selected as a Muns of Civil Judge after proper selection process conducted by UP Public Service Commission and joined on 31-8-1987. My Lord has been promoted in the higher judicial services on 28-2-2005 and has also been appointed as a district judge in several 
districts. My Lord has been elevated to the Justice of the Allahabad High Court on 21-6-2022. I have been occasion to appear before my Lord in division bench in some cases. And I find that my Lord's approach was very positive and also has handled the court proceeding in a very sweet and cool manner. My Lord is demanding his office as a judge of the High Court today. I myself and also on behalf of the member of the bar, peace and pray to the God to your Lordships and your family members for a bright future and happy life. Thank you. <clears throat> Honorable the Chief Justice Justice Rajesh Vinder, Honorable Justice Saeed Fair Mia, Honorable Judges, respected family members, better half, Shri Shashi Prakash Singh, additional Solicitor General, Shri Ajit Kumar Singh, additional Advocate General, Shri Radha Khan Thoja, President, High Court Bar Association, respected seniors and members of the bar. My Lord was born on 5th January 1961 and your Lordship was appointed as Mansik in the year 1987 and promoted to higher judicial seven services in 2005 and later on became the district judge and elevated to the just of the Allahabad High Court on 21st June 2022. Your Lordship had the advantage of being district judge and therefore aware of the working condition, problems and judici of the judicial officers and members of the Bar Association and other problems related to the employee of the court. When your Lordship was elevated as a judge of the Honorable Court, High Court, was Lordship was fully equipped to handle situations but got a very short time to this as a judge of the High Court. During his Lordship tenure as a judge of this court, it has been observed by the members of the bar of your acute sense of justice. A fine blending of rigid laws and flexible justice has given exceptional result. No members of the bar has ever left your Lordship court this control with the feeling of injustice within that in this case. Your Lordship has always accommodated the members of the bar and dispensation of justice has been hallmark of your Lordship tenure. Advocate Association today has a mixed feeling of joy and sadness. Joy for your Lordship has been completed fine and successful tenure as and sadness for the day as it is. Advocate Association bids your Lordship farewell. Thank you. This respected uh, sister and brother judges, president of the Bar Association, president uh, advocate association High Court Allahabad, other of uh, office bearer of the Bar Associations and members of the Bar Associations, and also. Additional Solicitor General of India, Advocate, Additional Advocate General of Uttar Pradesh, Representing Advocate General of Uttar Pradesh, and uh, other members of the bar. Also, my better half, Srimati Munta Chauhan, and uh, my nephew, who is also a practicing at High Court daily. So yes, Kamran and Ali and officers of the registry. I shall prefer to speak uh, in Hindustani, in Hindi. Yes, I can say that the time to have what I make a lot of us are not coming on. लेकिन मुझे ऐसे लगता है कि मेरे लिए ये बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट रहा क्योंकि इस समय में इस समय अवधि में 
मुझे आप लोगों के साथ काम करने में बहुत सीखने का मौका मिला और डिस्ट्रिक्ट जुडिशरी में रहने पर हमें यहाँ की वर्किंग का आइडिया नहीं था या मेरे साथ फॉर्चुनेटली ये भी हुआ कि हमारे ऑनरेबल चीफ चीफ साहब ने कि हमें जो डिवीजन बेंच में एक सिटिंग दी तो उसमें सबसे पहले लखनऊ में मौका मिला मुझे रंजन साहब ऑनरेबल रंजन साहब के साथ फिर ऑनरेबल अंजनी कुमार मिश्रा साहब ऑनरेबल अश्वनी कुमार मिश्रा साहब और काफी लंबा जो मेरा वक्त गुजरा वो ऑनरेबल सुनील कुमार साहब के साथ गुजरा तो आप खास तौर से सभी से मुझे सीखने का मौका मिला सभी से स्नेह मिला सभी से कोऑपरेशन मिला लेकिन विशेष रूप से ये जो मैंने अभी नाम उल्लेख किए इनके साथ बैठने इनके साथ मुझे बहुत अच्छा एक्सपीरियंस रहा और बहुत सीखने का मौका मिला इसने मिला और आपने मुझे ये एहसास नहीं होने दिया कि जैसे कि मैं इस सिस्टम में नया आया था डिस्ट्रिक्ट कोर्ट से आया था और ये भी था कि मुझे बहुत कम टाइम तक यहाँ रहना है लेकिन इसके बावजूद मुझे जो है वो इस चीज का आप लोगों ने एहसास नहीं होने दिया इसके लिए मैं आप सब लोगों का ऑनरेबल ब्रदर्स आप पार्क के पदाधिकारी और ऑफिस पेरेंट्स मेंबर्स अवधि बार सभी का मैं शुक्रगुजार हूँ और विशेष रूप से ऑनरेबल चीफ जस्टिस साहब का अपने बहुत शुक्रगुजार हूँ कि आपने इस मुझे मौका दिया वैसे तो फेयरवेल का दिन जो है जिसका फेयरवेल है ये जो ऑफिस डिबेट करता है उसके लिए बहुत कुछ कहने का नहीं होता है जिस सिस्टम में हम काम करते हैं तो उस सिस्टम के जो उस सिस्टम से जो जुड़े हैं आप लोग जुड़े हैं तो ये उस अफसर के आकलन का समय होता है इसमें हमारे लिए बहुत ज्यादा कुछ कहने का नहीं होता ये आप लोगों के आकलन का होता है कि आप लोग जो है किस तरह से जो है जो जो जाने वाला है वो किस तरह से आप उसका आकलन करते हैं तो जो भी इस तरह से किया है लेकिन आप लोगों का बड़प्पन ये है कि आप लोग जो है वो तारीफ कर देते हैं हिम्मत अफजाई कर देते हैं छोटी मोटी बातें होती हैं उनको नजरअंदाज कर देते हैं ये आप लोगों का भी बड़प्पन है इसके साथ साथ मैं इस मौके पर अपने फैमिली मेंबर्स को भी याद करना चाहूंगा उनको ट्रिब्यूट करना चाहूंगा मेरे फादर जो है वो जिस हम एक टाउन है डिस्ट्रिक्ट बरेली में सरोली मैं वहां का नेटिव हूँ तो मेरे फादर उस टाइम में एट्टी वन में डेथ हुई मेरे फादर की एट्टी वन में डेथ हुई तो बहुत तो यानी कि वहाँ नगर पंचायत है हम लोगों की वहाँ लगातार बाईस तेईस साल चेयरमैन रहे डिस्ट्रिक्ट बोर्ड के चेयरमैन रहे ही हेड सो मैनी प्रेस्टिजियस पोस्ट ड्यूरिंग हिज लाइफ टाइम कॉलेज है हमारे यहाँ डिस्ट्रिक्ट बोर्ड का उसके वो मैनेजर भी रहे सेक्रेटरी भी रहे तो सबसे इम्पोर्टेंट बात ये थी उनकी कि उनका चरित्र जो था वो बहुत शानदार था बहुत ऑनेस्ट थे और पूरा चरित्र उन्होंने अपना यानी ईमानदारी से त्रास भी रहे तो हमारे जो पेरेंट्स रहे उन्होंने यानी हमारे अंदर जो इंटरकेट किया वो यही किया कि भाई आप ईमानदारी से अपना काम करिए और बगैर किसी पक्षपात के काम करिए मेरा उसको ट्रिब्यूट करना चाहूंगा मैं फिर ये है कि हम कुछ भी नहीं बन सकते अगर हमें हमारे जो गुरुजन हैं उनका अगर हमें आशीर्वाद नहीं या उन वही सब हुए पेरेंट्स के बारे में सबसे बड़ा स्थान जो है वो हमारे गुरुजनों का होता है तो वही हमें इस लायक बनाते हैं कि हम सफल हो सके हैं कुछ और कोई पद बद में जाए कुछ हम कुछ अपना काम कर सकें तो मैं उनको भी ट्रिब्यूट करता हूँ अपने जो मेरे टीचर्स रहे प्रोफेसर्स रहे और मेरा रिटायरमेंट मेरा 2019 में जब एलिवेशन हुआ और फिर यानी मेरा रिटायरमेंट हो गया जनवरी 2021 में एट दिस इज डेट फ्राम अमरोहा तब टाइम गुजर गया 
रिवीजन में तो मैं थोड़ा सा ये हो गया नाउमीद हो गया कि अब जो है वो शायद जो है यहाँ आप लोगों के साथ बैठने का आप लोगों के साथ काम करने का मौका ना मिला पर न मिला लेकिन उसमें मेरे साथ एक ऐसी आप सुखद घटना हुई कि मैं मैंने शादी नहीं की थी सिंगल था रिटायरमेंट के टाइम भी मैं सिंगल ही था लेकिन रिटायरमेंट के बाद में मैंने साहब शादी कर ली तो मेरी मिसेज बैठी है मिसेज मिसेज मुमताज चौहान और वो लेडी लग गई है इसको कि उस लेडी लक की वजह से साहब मेरा जो है काम चल गया और मैं यहाँ तक पहुंच गया <laughs> तो इस मौके पर मैं अपनी बेगम अपनी बीवी बेटर हाफ मुमताज चौहान का भी शुक्रिया अदा करना चाहूंगा और इस मौके पर ये मेरे नेफ्यू हुए हैं ये कम फ्रॉम डेली जस्ट टू बी पार्ट ऑफ दिस प्रेस्टिजियस एंड मेमोरेबल शर्म शर्मैन तो मैं इनका भी शुक्रिया अदा करना चाहूंगा कि आप वहां से इस दूर से आए इस खातिर आए और आखिर में मैं बहुत तो आप सभी लोगों का आभारी हूँ बहुत तो आप लोगों का शुक्रगुजार हूँ आप सबका बहुत चीफ साहब का और मेरे जो रेस्पेक्टेड सिस्टर डेज है उनका और जो है बस आखिर में ये भी बात है कि जब हम लोग एक जगह काम करते हैं तो कभी कभी परिवार में भी छोटी मोटी बातें होती हैं तो इस मौके पे ये भी जरूर कहेंगे भाई साहब जो है अगर हमारे बिहेवियर से या हमारी जुबान से शब्दों से अल्फाजों से अगर कोई ऐसी वैसी बात हो कोई जिन्हें अदरवाइज फील किया हो हर्ट फील किया हो या किसी को लगा हो तो वो हम लोग दानिश्ता नहीं करते हैं फैसला नहीं करते हैं जानबूझ नहीं करते फिर भी मैं इतना रिक्वेस्ट करूंगा आप सब लोगों से कि आप लोग उसको जो है वो नजरअंदाज कर देंगे और आकर आप लोग का आभार दें थैंक यू